hysteroscopy with the suction morselator, the new gold standard for minimally invasive same-day surgery for problems inside the uterus. Hi, I'm Dr. Kevin M. Johnson and I'm here once again to provide yet more insight into why small is good. I know what you're thinking. You're already convinced. Okay, but here's more. Overlake Reproductive Health is proud to be at the forefront of what is to become the new gold standard for the minimally invasive removal of submucosal fibroids and endometrial polyps. We are one of only a few clinics in Washington State to offer morselator hysteroscopy procedures to our patients. We were among the first in the country to utilize this technology and have amassed sufficient experience to become the only training site in the Pacific Northwest and one of six nationally. Hystroscopic operations performed using the suction morselator offer several advantages over older, more conventional removal techniques of submucosal myomas or uterine fibroids and endometrial polyps. Fibroids are the most common benign tumors of the uterus. They can cause a variety of symptoms including painful periods, abnormally heavy or irregular periods, pelvic pain, and infertility. Endometrial polyps are a common abnormality of the uterine lining. The uterine lining is made up of soft endometrial tissue that is shed each month if a woman does not become pregnant, causing a period. After a woman's period, the lining rapidly grows back in order to support another possible pregnancy. Polyps are areas that grow too much and don't get shed, often resulting in a tree-like stalk with a larger bushy head attached to it. There can be single or multiple growths. These growths are diagnosed in approximately 20% of women with abnormal uterine bleeding. They can also interfere with proper implantation of the fertilized egg and may cause miscarriages if not removed. Heavy bleeding is one of the most commonly reported problems found by primary care practitioners. It can certainly severely impact a patient's life by disrupting work, family, and social events. If it is not treated, it can lead to anemia as well as pelvic pain and cramping. Endometrial polyps and uterine fibroids are common causes of this abnormal bleeding, and if you are among those currently experiencing any of these symptoms, you should get checked out by your doctor. The suction morselator takes away the need for the surgeon to constantly remove the cut tissue, as it can cut and remove tissue simultaneously. Taking away this time-consuming step throughout the procedure is a huge benefit to the patient as it results in a much reduced operating time. A recent study showed that this new technique reduced average operating times for the removal of fibroids and polyps by half. This reduces the patient's exposure to anesthesia and greatly lowers the risk of absorbing too much fluid. The risk of puncturing the uterus from multiple entries of surgical equipment is also reduced. More importantly, by using the suction morselator, we can achieve complete removal of the fibroid more often and with less damage to the uterus. Finally, the morselator doesn't make use of electric current to excise tissue. This reduces the risk of both too much water absorption and electrical or heat inj injury. In short, the use of the suction morselator to perform operative hysteroscopies is, in our opinion, the new gold standard in the removal of submucosal fibroids and endometrial polyps. It minimizes the risks of more conventional techniques while offering a safer and more efficient removal of these growths. We were among the first physicians in the country to adopt this exciting new technique and have extensive experience performing these procedures. If you have been experiencing abnormal uterine bleeding, heavy painful periods, or have already been diagnosed with endometrial polyps or fibroids, call us today to schedule a consultation. Small is good. The results are extraordinary.